I've always thought of like the revision polytheism of of this whole thing more in like I guess the right word for it would be like a Jungian way like the same way people do tarot or like um crystals where it's it's unlocking a part of your subconscious like by manifesting like this thing that is the essence of something and so I think of the gods of being like good and bad sides of certain traits of certain um areas of domain so to speak and um you know it's more concepts it's more parables in my head at least yeah, i can talk about like i like the like tarot readings on myself or other people and so i can that's a, actually a good analogy because like some people get really really dogmatic also with that where like they like the cards of the tarot deck has like a certain meaning and the and they get like very like myopic about it where like oh this card has this meaning so this is the only thing that it could possibly mean when that's not that's not really what like tarot is intended to be it's intended to be something that helps you like tap into like your own personal intuition and things like that and so like if you get a card that means one thing but something pops in your head that tells you maybe this actually means something else that's what you should actually go with because that's the whole purpose of tarot but like if you're using it to be like very dogmatic like that and be like no this is the only answer then you're basically like defeating the purpose of why you're even using it in the first place 